Today we're going to be trying Bud Light flavors. I know I look terrible. I do not feel well. I've not been feeling well the last while. And I have to pause because my neighbors need some work and he's got it. Well, sorry guys, but if there's a little bit of noise of the neighbor, well, there's nothing I can do. But we're doing a review. First time trying Bud Light. There's three, uh, excuse me, four different flavors. There's three of those flavors each. Coming to a total of 12 in a pack. There's strawberry lemonade. That sounds good on its own, but to put it with beer, all right. There's mango. Love mango. Put it with a beer. All right. Lime. Well, who doesn't like a little lime in their beer? Whether it goes with Bud Light beer, I don't know, but all right. And then finally, peach. So we have some little bites we're going to have. These are kind of like a, a, a jerk chicken um, curry type of spicy taste. So I've decided I'm going to go with the mango. I may drink all three. I may only drink one. We'll soon see. But again, I've been very tired lately. So sorry, I don't look the best. But life goes on. The show must go on. So that's what happened. So I don't buy these too often. So I know sometimes there's a way to open it so that you kind of have it like a dispenser thing. This does not appear to have that. But it does have a neat thing, I guess, where it's perforated so that when you pick it up, the box doesn't break. It, it's giving allowance for the drinks to uh, move, I guess. But the thing is, how do you open it? Um, how to open the box? <laughs> well, anyway, click like and subscribe. Hit that notification bell for any upcoming videos of me being silly, sometimes being informative, like this, trying new things or trying new things like this and telling you how it tastes, my opinion of my taste buds. Or simply sitting and having a mukbang sing. So soon, so remember to share. Because Sherry is scary and want to get out there. I'm the girl who likes to show for you, Villa. Before and after she eats. So if it's not something you want to see, sure you keep watch for the heading. Because if you see in a tongue in it, it's because you'll be sure to see my mouth open. So with that, let me do this review. And shut up. Because we're doing a review, review though, or if I'm doing challenges or doing things to do with other channels, I will not be opening my mouth, so sorry. But yeah, let's try this. Let's see how it is. Um, again, I don't know how to open it, so I'm just going to open it from this side. Now, it appears, oh, the yellow can is the mango. But what's closest to me is the peach and lime. So I'm thinking lime will go good with this. So let's try lime. Ugh. I don't really want to break the box all up. Let's try and cut it. Guys, it's 
kids who live down the street. God, my eyes look more dark than I realize. Not standing in front of the mirror so I don't realize how bad I look compared to how I feel. And I don't feel well, so I guess I look just as bad as I feel. <laughs> that makes sense. Cheers! Ooh, nice can. Pretty. Love this color. Mmm. Really clearly showing it's lime flavor. Light beer with natural flavor. This is 4% these beers. And again, it's light beer. So let's see what it tastes like. The can is very thin. The way it was when I was a younger person. Tricky. Oh god, I look terrible, but I don't care. Laugh at me if you want. Going through many things right now. Cheers. You have to keep your head up high and fake it till you make it, or pretend, or I don't know, but try not to stay sad too long. Cry if you need to, but don't cry too long. Okay. It almost smells like lime cleaner. Ugh, let me not keep smelling it. Ah. It's very smooth. That has your typical beer taste. You know? Since my concussion, I find that I would like to taste alcohol. Period. Oh. It doesn't taste bad. Ooh, it's hot in there. I have some leftover carbuncle bean from the beginning of the week. Stick it in the freezer. I have so much in the freezer. If I stick it in there, I may not eat it. A lot. I don't eat big breast. <laughs> Some nice beer. The only thing is, I was keeping the beer in my room. And then I didn't um, put them in the fridge. Don't ask me why. Probably so I don't even drink them. There's olives in here, chicken, garbanzo beans, tomato. Actually, it turns out that I'm glad I picked a lime after all.
and it's salty, so it goes with bread with this even more. But we'll have to see how I feel after two D if I get a buzz or not. <laughs> That bite had the um, olive and chicken. You ever have something like a bug that's on the white paint and you have to get it off? Well, then some kind of like burn mark on the ceiling is like, what the heck? I know I did not do that. Like these people that are crazy, I tell you. Oh. If you ever think I wonder if you're crazy, I don't know I do. There's always someone more crazy. Why would they do that? You're stupid, noof. Been here for four months. Why would I now start suddenly doing something bad? But yeah, the other day I go to feed my fish. The damn fish, there's like some kind of white stuff on top. Of not powder, but... If I can put it that way, or if I... I don't know. Almost like... Um, really good, well crushed, not ground up, but crushed eggshells or something, but that float, it's like really small little piece of particles. And this was after I had cleaned the water the next day, and I've had that jellyfish fish for four months. You know, some people are just mean. I don't know why I feel tired. I could deal with some mean people this week. Manipulating my day and finances. It was hot in there. Now that my neighbor's dead, I can look at it. I'm the window. The grass and weeds are like five feet in some places, on average four feet. Don't like to clean up. It's a can paint. Let's see how this tastes with my mouth. Salty.
it kind of tastes artificial. Uh, well, not kind of. It does. The lemon taste, and lime. Kind of tastes more like the um, what do you call it? The peel. Like you know how the peel tastes really strong. And it's kind of tasty. I find them more tired when it's overcast or raining. Does that affect you as well when you don't have some? It's so gristle. But yeah. Like I said, it's kind of hard for me to say how good it is when I kind of find that it. I'm the opposite of what they say that they must go on some of the effects where you have lack of taste, taste or smell. Here's my confession. Um, Um, oh, I remember actually, um, what happened is that, uh, oh, my taste buds are oversensitive, so it's the opposite of everybody, I don't know what's option. Oh, But yeah, this definitely is not something in that I would drink alone. It almost seems like it has to be paired with food. Mm. You know, I'm just gonna go out to the restaurant, a sushi buffet. Bye. Um, International Sushi Day. But I can't afford it. I need to keep my money for a funeral flight and accommodations. been taking you for a garden tour in a while. I'm gonna have to do that. Oh, not feeling
feeling it. You know how sometimes if you're like somebody, your pal, your buddy or whatever, like, come on, have a drink. Like, no, I'm good. Then you have it. It's like, hmm, this tastes good. Yeah. <laughs> and then, I swear that somebody was in this room messing around with my shite. Why do people like to mess with people's stuff? Lazy. Won't clean up his share of the house. Won't do different things. Not even in the yard away from me. If he doesn't want to like feel like he doesn't do it right. I don't know. But he just doesn't do nothing at all. It's, just, it's like, you think I'm your maid, buddy? I did not make my agreement with the landlord to clean up after you. But yeah, no, I don't know if I like this or not. Maybe it would be better if it was cold. <sighs> oh. oh, I'm tired. Do I think I want to go to a buffet? I thought, no way. $50 would cost me, like, pretty much between five, six, seven dollars a bite. That's why I would only last through. <laughs> well, no, let's say I'd take four or five items. You know what I mean? Like I'd take maybe five or six items at the max. And it would come to almost 60 bucks with tax and those, or tips. That's probably on the cheap end. So imagine that I took a plate like this and then you can't eat it. Mm, a lot of these places do crap. MSG. But fix your mind. Uh, oh. I'm thinking that it's good. But meanwhile, it's just the salt. Or whatever is in there, I don't know. Mm -mm. Ouch. Ugh.
Jonathan without eating in a restaurant is if you suddenly become tired from eating. Like at home, you can just go and sleep. He was trying to get somebody's attention. Um. I know as I'm not drinking this anymore. I'm tired. I'm too tired. And I, I obviously just don't like it. It's like... I remember one time I uh, was making some drinks and you know how some people do drink Clamato with their beer. So I was doing that and I quite liked it. But then I had run out of the Clamato, or I was running out of the Clamato, but I had some beer, uh, an apple juice while I was drinking my beer. So what happened is, um, yeah, as before I ran out of the Clamato, I started mixing it and diluting it with some apple juice. And it was tasting so good because now it was kind of sweet, not as bitter. So I have been mixing those drinks for the last 20 years. I've been mixing in my beer. So, but yeah. But that back then, I didn't drink bad beer. I didn't drink cheap beer. So that could be the difference. <laughs> Not saying this tastes cheap or bad, but. I don't know if it's this beer or not, but whoa, I'm extremely tired right now. Oh, oh, I'm not going. Oh, let me finish the last of it. This can. Oh, Ooh. that's the most bizarre. But I'm not so hot, but still. Good night. <laughs> Ugh. I had that yucky last the minute stuff in there. Anyways, guys, have a great weekend. I'm sorry I'm not feeling that well these days. I just have too much going on, personal things. I'm trying to be happy and fake it be happy but I'm not happy but I'm putting a smile on just for you so I'll see you in my happier videos so make sure that you go check them out I'll see you soon